kids starting to go a little stir crazy or parents are they driving you crazy no never <laughs> never 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 uh, no all. we are really excited to try this next thing out though it's play-doh to the rescue rebecca cole shows us a natural and handmade recipe for fun with a little football thrown in <laughs> Do you know what sporting team is purple? No. No, no, what football team wears this color? You don't know, do you? Because it's not important. Vikings. Ah, who? Vikings. Vikings? Vikings? What color? Hey, what about these two colors right there? Yellow, green. Yeah, who, who wears yellow and green? Um, Packers. Packers. Who's the best, Vikings or Packers? Yeah. Who's the best? Um, maybe a bright. Oh my gosh, I'm done. So for this recipe, you need five simple ingredients you probably already have in your pantry. Flour, water, cream of tartar, salt, and oil. And of course, food coloring if you want to create different colors. So we'll start, here I'll let you do it Quinn. I need one cup of flour into the pan please. One cup. Nice. Okay, how about one cup of warm water? Pour it in gently. And why don't you sprinkle on one quarter cup of table salt? Sprinkle all around. And then two teaspoons. This is cream of tartar. Can you say that? Mr. Tartar. That was close. That was really I good. Hold that one for me. Okay. One teaspoon. Can you say avocado oil? Avocado oil. That's really close. And you can use vegetable oil if you want, um, olive oil as well. Okay, so we're going to mix that up. And then wanna you want to do it? Okay, you mix it. And then what we're going to do is put this on the stove at medium, medium high heat, stirring constantly. So see how it's starting to get lumpy and it's pulling away from the pan. This is an indication it's getting really close. We're going to keep turning it until it sets up a little more. Okay, so there you go. See, it just pulls away from the pan. We're going to put it out and let it cool just a bit before we handle it. Now, what color would you like to make this dough? Um, blue. Blue. That my favorite color. Blue is your favorite color? All yeah, right. And that's favorite color. And your dad's favorite color? Yeah. Now, I don't want you to squeeze it too hard. Just let it drop out gently. One, two, three, four, five. Then we're going to roll this up. This can get messy. And if you don't, if you're worried about that, you can just put it in, let's put it in a Ziploc bag and you can squish it all you want. Squish, squish, squish. squish, squish. See? See, and we're going to squish it back and forth, just knead it, and see, you can see it starts turning colors. So squish it up, and eventually this will become this. Yep. Beautiful Play-Doh, easy to play with, easy to shape, and you can create almost any color under the rainbow. Yep. You like doing this one? Yep. Is this your favorite craft, or yep. you think so? I'm going, to be, I'm going to do math after I go home. Math? Yeah. Play-Doh to math, just like her grandma Gogo. I'm Gogo, or Rebecca, staying safe in the backyard with Quinn. Well, you and I got to spend a little more time together watching football. And make sure you check out Gogo's Instagram page for more of her DIY gardening tips.